guys, I am impressed. They have the same exact um, texture as Starbucks. 10 out of 10. I would literally order this all the time. This is so good, it's so flavorful. These, um, usually I would prefer these in the air fryer. I mean, air fryer, I'm so used to saying that. And we're just gonna sprinkle a little bit of parsley just to make it look fancy. morning guys welcome back to my oh, let me take this out welcome back to my channel this morning if you're new welcome my name is kim and if you're not welcome back today's video is going to be another what i eat in a day with my keto friendly and low carb meals so we're gonna just jump right into it it is currently 10 o'clock. I just made coffee and it's really cold today in Pittsburgh. So I decided to make hot coffee in my little Yeti cup. I love my Yeti cup guys so much. It keeps everything super hot or super cold, but I've been seeing everyone having these, um, these new cups called Stanley cups. Yeah, Stanley cups. I really want one. So I might, I don't know go and splurge on one um they usually they have them at like dicks and stuff so we'll go check it out there um but yeah i heard that those cups are like really good well i don't know if they're really good i don't know if it's like just like really hyped up because literally i see everyone on tiktok having a stanley cup and i'm like why is everyone so obsessed with the cup so we'll see i'm gonna buy one and then i'll let you guys know but if you guys have a stanley cup leave me a comment let me know if you love it or not and like what is the hype all about let me know i need to know so anyway we're gonna have some coffee and yeah i hope you guys enjoy today's what i eat today and if you're wondering for my creamer i used a tablespoon of this silk almond creamer which only has 25 calories and four grams of carbs so the rule of thumb is that if you're fasting once you go over 50 calories like once you consume over 50 calories you are breaking your fast but if you stay under 50 calories you are considered your body is still fasting so that is what i've learned in the keto and fasting world so anyway i wanted to show you guys the creamer that i used So for breakfast today guys, we are going to have these egg bites. I got this from my local grocery store, Giant Eagle. They kind of are packaged like the Starbucks egg bites um, and there's lots of protein. They have bacon and cheese, cage free eggs with bacon, Monterey cheese and cheddar cheese. There's two of them in here, 300 grams, I mean 300 calories. Um, and about two grams of net carbs. So easy instructions. Let's see, peel back, film, and remove paper tray. Yeah, so we're gonna have this. This is already packed with protein, but then I'm also gonna do two of these sausage links. So this is gonna be my quick breakfast along with my coffee. I feel like these are super convenient if you are in the office i when i was in the office i could picture myself buying a bunch of these and taking these to work if they're really good so okay so you'll leave it in this tray and then we'll microwave it for a minute and a half so along with my youtube videos i want to start posting tiktoks on my tiktok so i'm gonna put my tiktok right here if you guys could follow me on tiktok that would be awesome i think i only have like one low carb video on there and then the other videos are just like random videos um that i've just been posting throughout the year but i only have like four videos on there so it's not like a lot but and then i want to start posting more shorts on youtube um because youtube is really encouraging all creators and all vloggers to post shorts so i think i'm going to start doing that that way like i'll have my regular vlogs which i love making and then i'll have like my shorts where it's like okay what i eat in a day um for example and it's like a 60 second video of like what I eat and like I know some of you guys love the long uh, vlogs and I know like some of you guys love like the quick TikTok vlogs um, or videos so that's what I'm planning to do so I just have to find time um, to do that so yeah that's 
that's what's happening right now. Oh guys, I am impressed. They have the same exact um, texture as Starbucks egg bites where it's kind of like bouncy because they have, um, they're made with like cottage cheese. At least that's what I think. <laughs> that's what makes it like bouncy and like thick. Let me take a picture. We're gonna take it off the tray, even though you could just leave it in there to save a plate, but. Ooh, look at that texture, guys. If you ever had um, egg bites from Starbucks, you'll know what I mean. Like, this is like fluffy and soft. Okay, let's take a bite. Mmm. -hmm. Guys, it literally tastes like Starbucks egg bites. Gosh, I can't believe it's so good. Mmm. It might be better than Starbucks. Like, honestly. Mmm. I don't want to eat all of it yet because I'm still waiting for my sausage. But that's really good. I'm going to show you guys the packaging again. Try it if you guys have it at your grocery store. They might even sell it at Target. But they were next to the eggs. So wherever your eggs are in the you know cold section, they were like right above it. So okay, I've got my sausage here, and I already ate one of these egg bites. Let me take this out of its thing. But mmm, so good. Okay, I'm gonna have this for breakfast. I have my hot sauce on the side. I don't think I need it, but I brought it out just in case. But yeah, we're gonna have our breakfast and I'm excited for lunch, so I'll see you guys at lunch. Okay guys, it is time for lunch and I am so excited for lunch because I just got my Green Chef delivery kit in a few days ago. So we are going to make one of these delicious keto friendly meals for lunch today and I've literally been standing here for like five minutes trying to figure out which one I want to make. So if you are unfamiliar with Green Chef, Green Chef is a CCOF certified organic company. Um, they have meals for literally every lifestyle, whether you're doing keto like me, paleo, if you're vegan, vegetarian, fast and fit, Mediterranean, or gluten free. So they literally have an option for every lifestyle. You guys know me, we are doing keto, so I chose the keto friendly meals this week. And they literally all look so good. I just don't even know what I want to make. Oh, do I want kale salad with pork, Mediterranean chicken? Oh, this one looks really good. Italian shrimp garden bowl. You know what? Okay, I'm torn between kale salad with pork or Italian shrimp garden bowl. Okay, so we're gonna do the Italian shrimp garden bowl and then we're gonna save these two for dinner, maybe tonight or tomorrow, later in the week. So let's get started. Green Chef makes cooking so easy so you can spend less time stressing and more time enjoying delicious home-cooked meals. With Green Chef, you get organic produce and premium protein so you can feel great about what you're eating and how it got to your table. This is the easiest way to eat keto, paleo, vegan, vegetarian, or even if you're carb conscious. This is the number one best meal kit for eating well. Okay, so I cut up all of the veggies, seasoned the shrimp, so now we are going to saute the walnuts. And add the bag of cabbage. So they also gave me a little packet of seasonings. There's garlic, paprika, and herb blend. Already pre-measured, pre-packaged, so. And just in time for the new year, guys, Green Chef is introducing an easier way to eat keto. With their new limited time Keto Kickoff 2023, you can now order keto meals for breakfast and dinner. You'll find more delicious keto options than ever before. And I timed it, guys. It literally took me 20 minutes to make lunch. So easy. 
Hey guys, I let this sit for a few minutes just to let everything come together, melt, get all the flavor in. So I'm gonna plate my lunch now. So lunch is ready. Let's try it. Oh, I already tasted it, but we're gonna taste it together. Just a cabbage mix. Mm -mm. So well seasoned. The onion, the red pepper. Mm. Honestly, if it wasn't for a green chef, I would not ever think of this combination with the peppers and the cabbage and the onion seasoned sauteed together so that's why i love green chef because you're trying different foods that you never would be like even think of mm. okay the shrimp mm. Mm. that garlic sauce at the end oh my gosh with the parmesan cheese guys this is so yummy mmm 10 out of 10. I would literally order this all the time. This is so good, it's so flavorful. And start to finish, it literally took me 20 minutes to make. So so I want you guys to try Green Chef too. You guys can use my code KIM60 for 60% 60 off plus free shipping. You can go to greenchef.com for more details. I will have everything linked down below in my description box, but don't forget to use my code KIM60. I will also have it on the screen here for you guys, but we're gonna finish lunch. And then I'll see you guys at dinner. Ah, you can't forget the walnuts. Yum. Hey guys, it's dinner time. Trying to put something together that Jamal can also eat tonight because he is working right now. So we are going to be making meatballs, his favorite. So I'm going to go ahead and cook these and then I know we have a sugar-free barbecue somewhere. And I'm not gonna tell Jamal that it's sugar-free. I'm just gonna let him eat it i don't think he'll notice though but um yeah so let's cook these up usually i would prefer these in the air fryer i mean air fryer i'm so used to saying that in the crock pot simmered or cooked on low for like eight hours but we don't have time for that right now so we're just gonna get the red pan out here and throw these on the skillet Also gonna make a bag of green beans. This is easy, just throw it in the microwave. Pretty clean ingredients, even though it's not like fresh green beans, so. All right, I'm gonna put this back in the microwave. So here's the green beans. They taste so good because they're seasoned. I threw butter. Very quick, very easy. Let me get my plate together. I made cauliflower rice for myself and then I made this roasted chicken yellow rice for the fam. So we're gonna add a little bit of cauliflower rice on the bottom and I'm gonna top it with the meatballs. I'm only gonna do three beans. And we're just gonna sprinkle a little bit of parsley just to make it look fancy. Okay guys, and this is dinner tonight. It was so simple, so easy to make, and I just made mine keto friendly. Again, my family had this rice here, green beans, rice, cauliflower rice, and I have three meatballs here with sugar-free barbecue sauce, and Jamal did not even notice. Anyway, let's have dinner.